Hi everyone, Ironclad Cobra here and welcome to another quick unboxing first impressions video. Today I'm featuring the MSI Claw, a great Windows handheld PC or x86 handheld PC. Despite the mixed reviews about this device, I wanted to give it a try. I got this a couple of days ago during the Amazon Prime Day deals. It was down from 700 euros to 500 and I thought for a 7 inch Windows handheld device 500 euros is still a great deal. So I'll do a quick unboxing first impressions video and of course later in the next couple of days as I always do I'll share some gameplay videos probably a comparison video against the ROG Ally or the Steam Deck because I have the ROG Ally and the Steam Deck and I said why not having the MSI Claw as well so let me go through the unboxing together this is the package as you see with the cool picture of the Claw on this side there's nothing just some branding and I think at the back Let's see what do we have here. Some information about the seller. I think this is coming from uh, the Netherlands with the MSI logistics that they have in Europe. On this side we have some info as well. As you know this is the first handheld PC that has an Intel chipset inside. There are two versions. The high end has the Ultra 7 Intel chipset. I got the low end version, which is the Intel uh, 5 Ultra chipset. So let's have a look here. And I think we have the specs here as well. If you'd like to take a screenshot, 7 inch Full HD IPS screen with 120 Hz refresh rate. Intel Core Ultra 5 135 Hz processor with the Intel Arc graphics and it has 500 gigs of SSD storage and LPDR5 16 gigs of RAM Wi-Fi 7 Windows 11 Home pre-installed and I think there will be a spec sheet inside as well so, the back on the sides, nothing special, just some cool designs of the claw. On this side as well, the MSI logo. And there you go. So, let's unbox it together. Okay. Let's look at the content of the box. Here are some steps and instructions grip and game okay let's see nothing special here this is the unit itself We'll look at it in a minute. Let's see what's inside here. This is probably the user's manual and the guarantee card. This is the charging unit. I think it's a 53 watt battery. My guess would be 53 watt battery. As you see 
and it's a USB-C interface. And this is the cord as well. It's a European plug, as you see. And that's it. I guess there's nothing else. Cool. So, let's have a look. As we said, this is the manual. Quick guide. I guess. This is the unit itself. Wow, it's really a cool handheld. Let me just zoom in a bit. Okay. As I mentioned, it has a 7 inch IPS screen with 1920 by 1080p resolution and it's 500 nits. From holding the unit, it feels like next level gaming. The face buttons, re really high quality. These are RGB lighting as well, as you see here. The whole sensor analog sticks as well, as you see. And then here, the sticker for Intel Ultra 5. This is the processor, the low end. These are the speakers. There's nothing at the bottom, as you see. And then on top, let's look at what we have on top here. So we have the audio volume here, plus and minus, 3.5 millimeter audio jack. And then here the Thunderbolt 4, fast or turbocharging, micro SD card slot, and then fingerprint on and off button as well. Now I love the entire upper part because the whole part here is a vent to release or cool down the CPU because of the you know great performance that it will have. And then the shoulder buttons here they are a little bit clicky but it feels really really premium. The triggers are whole sensor as well as you see here. A bit clicky but I think that's not a bad thing. And then we have the d-pad here. Good quality as well. The analog sticks feel very, very good because they are whole sensor analog sticks as well. And then the interface buttons here on top, we have the menu button here. And then this is the quick settings menu or button. On the left, on top, we have the view button. And then below it, it has the MSI uh, launcher. Or MSI center. So that's what's on the front of the device. It feels very very edgy and sharp as you see here. At the back let's see what we have. Wow look at the back. The entire back plate is vents. Wow super cool and I love the MSI a dragon as well. Oh my goodness, this feels like long tube headers and a catback exhaust system 
that you find on an American muscle car. Wow, very, very cool. It feels like a gaming handheld. I love the design. And then here we have the two macro buttons that are programmable. As you see. And then the grips, as you see here. They are quite comfortable as well and ergonomic. It feels very, very good in the hands. If you want to have a closer look. Very, very ergonomic. Right away, ready to game. Yeah, I love it. I'm absolutely in love with this device. As I said, I'm quite interested to see the performance and despite the mixed reviews, I'm really, really interested to try gaming on this device. So I think that would be for today. As I mentioned, for 500 euros, I thought that's a still a great device to have with a 7 inch Full HD screen, Windows 11 Home pre-installed and Intel Core Ultra 5 processor. So I think that would be for today. Thanks for watching. Feel free to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And always remember, we don't stop gaming because we grow old. We grow old because we stop gaming.